Audiobook Academy Biography Presents. Sergey Brin. With Larry Page, Sergey Brin founded Google, which became the world's most popular search engine and a media conglomerate, making both Brin and Page multi-billionaires. Computer scientist and entrepreneur Sergey Brin. He and Larry Page invented a search engine that ranked online pages based on popularity at Stanford University. After starting in 1998, Google became the world's most popular search engine, making its co-founders billionaires. Later, Brin and Page served as president and CEO of Google's parent company, Alphabet, until they stepped down in December 2019. Early Years He was born in Moscow, Russia on August 21, 1973 as Sergei Mikhailovich Brin. A Soviet mathematician and economist's son, Brin fled the Soviet Union with his family to the United States in 1979 to escape anti-Semitism. After graduating from the University of Maryland at College Park with a degree in mathematics and computer science, Brin enrolled at Stanford University, where he met Larry Page. In computer science, both students were earning their doctoral degrees. When Google was just an idea, a search engine based on the popularity of web pages was developed by Stanford University researchers Brin and Page as a research project after it was determined that the most popular result would frequently be the most beneficial. Search engine Google was named after Google, which is a one followed by 100 zeros to highlight their goal of organizing the enormous amount of information available online. For their first business venture, the pair raised $1 million from family and other investors in 1998. Google went public in August 2004, making co-founders Sergey Brin and Larry Page multi-billionaires in the process. For the first time in its history, Google received more than a trillion queries per day in 2016. Achievement, Technology, and Development In 2006, Google paid $1.65 billion in stock to acquire YouTube, the world's most popular website for broadcasting user-submitted videos. Google Glass, a future pair of eyeglass computers with a touchpad and voice control, an LED illuminated display, and a camera, was unveiled by the company in 2012. For all the hype, worries about privacy and safety and a lack of a clear use case in everyday life ultimately hindered the economic viability of this product. Medical research reporting for news organizations, and even the military have all benefited from its technology. Google and its businesses were reformed on August 10, 2015, by Brin and Page, under the new parent company Alphabet, with Brin and Page serving as Alphabet's respective CEO and president. In November 2016, Forbes listed Brin as the 13th richest person in the world, and the 10th richest person in the United States. He made headlines early the following year for participating in a protest at San Francisco International Airport against President Trump's immigration policies, but he refused to comment beyond claiming he was there in a personal capacity. It was revealed on December 3, 2019, that Brin and Page would be stepping down from their daily jobs at Alphabet, but they were anticipated to continue involved in the firm as its two largest individual shareholders, as planned. Private Life he married 23 and me co-founder Ann Wojcicki in 2003 and had two children with her, a daughter and son. Since then, Bryn and Rosenberg have split after Bryn had an affair with Google Glass marketing manager Amanda Rosenberg in 2013. In 2018, Bryn tied the knot with businesswoman and lawyer Nicole Shanahan. It wasn't until a few months later that the news of their marriage and growing family was made public that they had a daughter. Thank you for listening in Audiobook Academy. Don't forget to subscribe and smash that like button for more content like this, see you in next video.